the roadside bomb changed the course of the wars in Iraq and Afghanistan. Whoa! These improvised explosive devices exploit one of the biggest weaknesses of America's military vehicles, their tires. No matter how much armor you add to a Humvee, it is still essentially riding on four balloons. Blow out those air-filled tires and soldiers become sitting ducks. Our convoy was just hit by an RPG, that's a rocket-propelled grenade, as soon as we entered the city limits of Baghdad. Fortunately, the RPG only hit the tires of a vehicle, no injuries. I was an embedded journalist in Iraq in 2004 when the army truck next to me was hit by a rocket-propelled grenade. The blast took out several tires and left the entire convoy pinned down in hostile territory. The very next day, road debris punctured yet another tire on one of the Humvees just outside Tikrit. We're not going to have a choice there, 06. That tire is gone. It is gone. We're on a rip right now. Okay, we're pulled over now. A flat tire is never convenient. It's certainly not convenient in enemy territory with people all around who may be trying to kill you. Air support was called in and the soldiers had to form a makeshift stockade just to change a single tire. The flat tire really uh, caused quite a bit of panic. This isn't supposed to happen. Humvees are equipped with so-called run flat tires. But in a combat zone, they don't get soldiers very far. They're being shot at, basically. They're not going to look at the speedometer, try to keep it under 30. They're not necessarily going to be within 30 miles of someplace safe. Enter the bulletproof tire, or as its inventors at Resilient Technologies call it, the non-pneumatic tire. It has no air, just a flexible plastic honeycomb that provides support while mimicking the shock-absorbing characteristics of a regular tire. And it really is bulletproof. This slow-motion test footage shows a high-powered rifle round passing right through the tire's honeycomb lattice, absorbing the impact without losing strength or mobility. Our number one goal here is to save lives. The Pentagon has funded development of the bulletproof tire, and the design is undergoing rigorous testing in resilience labs. The inventors hope to have these life-saving tires on military vehicles by 2011. Meanwhile, Michelin is developing a similar tire-wheel combination it calls the Tweel. Developers believe we could see these as standard equipment on our own passenger cars within a decade.